people might think that a musical about two feuding bordellos in the West Indies would be a toe-tapping good time. <laughs> <laughs> but if singing hookers can't fill the seats, what can? <laughs> that must have been the question on Truman Capote's mind when a house of flowers closed after only 165 performances in May of 1955. Based on his own short story featuring a wonder team of composer Harold Arlen and director Peter Brook, the musical seemed poised for success. But when the disastrous reviews were published, one reviewer said it was one of those musicals in which everything seems to have gone wrong. And, <laughs> and Truman Capone vowed to never return to the stage again. Here to sing the hit song, I Never Has Seen Snow. <laughs> 